We like sports and we don't care who knows From shooting hoops to the Super Bowl Just two normal guys hanging out, having fun Right, guy number two? Yeah, guy number one Watching sports with girls is a pain They don't know the rules, there's no time to explain Throw me the baseball Now toss me the big skin Now feed me the rock Now give me the rock Struggle, he's got one point Sagana Jop has never been accused of being a good free throw shooter. Not the best form no. I've seen from the knees with ease. When Ben Wallace is laughing uh, at you, that's bad. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the weekly sports report, the part two. If you didn't catch the other one, we did the Super Bowl, Super Bowl show, post game wrap up. Mm -hmm. ba, 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 ba. Who does number two work for? This show. Yeah. Yeah. Who does number two work for? Yeah, so now we're covering what we missed out on last week and covering in the future week here. Uh, this is Keele. This is Bill K. Welcome. And this is the show. We're starting off with Prince Fielder, mm -hmm. the million pound, million dollar man. <laughs> he's a vegan. Finally signed. Yeah. Finally signed with the Mariners. He's a slugger. He's going to bat in the... No, no, no. Don't the, crush my The anymore. De Trois Tigres. Mm hmm. Pick, picked up a hefty, yeah. hefty contract. Hefty, hefty, sit sack. Hefty, hefty, hefty. See? Not whippy, whippy, whippy. Hefty, hefty, hefty. Whippy, whippy, whippy. That's the problem, is it's like, you've got a, not a problem, it's great for Detroit. They yeah, got a yeah. righty power hitter who is huge. They got a lefty power hitter who is huge. Their problems are <laughs> where we put all yeah, those right, great yeah, players. Yeah. <laughs> and, and that's with ACL Terry out. Anyway, ACL Terry, shake it off. You put him back in the lineup. Be Mart. Whew. Man, Weavers. he's Victor Martinez. Oh, yeah, yo. Uh, Once he gets back, uh, that lineup is going to be some murderers row if they can all keep him around. So, uh, Tiger is going to be fun to watch, and they, they keep Verlaine. Not if you're an Indians fan. <laughs> Cleveland. God. Yeah. yeah. Uh, great for Detroit. Mariners. Mariners got hey, somebody. We got a slugger of our own. Carlos. One that we should have kept <laughs> from the 2001 season. Uh, oh, Mariners. This just continues. It's the Lincoln and Armstrong oh. show. What do we do next? <laughs> <sighs> Carlos Guillen back. Not sure he's even healthy enough no, to play no. 100 games. Yeah. There's Maybe like incentives if he even makes the roster. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not a big off-season sale, oh boy. Let's move on to yeah, something let's, else. Let's this please is, this go is on. depressing. Uh, NBA season so far, looking, you know, sort of the Lakers are not those guys anymore. No. But you're still kind of hanging around, but they're definitely not. They had something runners. good happen the other day. Anymore. They did. Well, they Kobe did. Bryant to overtaking did. Shaq. Fifth. Fifth. I guess he can win it without Shaquille. And that's how he beat Shaq. Mm-hmm. Because that's how I beat Shaq. Only my sister got that reference. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but the NBA right now led in the East by the Bulls, on the West by, you know, or okay. Voldemort and his people. Yeah, yeah. yeah. they are uh, doing doing some good stuff, and it's not a surprise with the with the compact schedule, which has been really kind of entertaining. It's like baseball; it's always on. Yeah. Um, but. You, you, you've got younger teams who have been together. They know how to work well. They didn't have any huge off-season um, signees that need to figure out the team. Duh, they're doing well. So, yeah. I mean, good for them. Derek Rose, a little dinged up. We'll see how long that lasts. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, you know, the, those front runners for OKC, that comes with a little grain of salt because poor Kendrick Perkins is going to be seeing <laughs> himself <laughs> over <laughs> and over <laughs> and over. Because Blake Griffin went off. I, can we <laughs> dunk for dunk of the year? Are we done? Can we not watch any more dunks? Because Durant, hands on right. hips. Are you kidding me, Kendrick? Del Negro wants a whistle, nothing coming. Paul finds Griffin inside. Oh, my goodness! Has lightning struck twice? We made us look like fools out there. Our keister is blowing in the wind. We got my keister blowing in the wind. Silver lining for Perkins, he'll be uh, on a lot of little boys' walls <laughs> across the nation. You're the guy that has, that has Blake Griffin in your uh, face! Uh, big NBA story, though. Dwight Howard, what do you think? If you're Orlando, do you trade him or do you keep him? I mean, it's seeming to be a Jerry problem, West says, it, write it out. Yeah, it, I mean, this seems like every week he's sort of like, oh, I can play for the Bulls. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't mind going to the Lakers. Oh, I could be over to the Clippers. Right. I, you know, I don't mind. It seems like he's picking a new team every week, so it's almost... Is this the Bachelor or something? I mean, you want to get rid of 
that, because it's kind of that cancer of the locker room to where it's like, well, where's your team loyalty? Now, you go to the locker room, it's like, you can be gone any week. You don't well, even care about being here. You just collect a check at this point. Why should we be playing hard for you? And that's what gets me is one week he'll say, yeah, oh, I want to go to the Clippers. The next he'll say, why are you guys playing hard out there for me? Yeah. I worked my butt off for yeah. this jersey. Shut <laughs> up, yeah. White. Uh -huh. We're going to keep him throughout through the All-Star break, I'm sure of it, because it's in Orlando. Yeah, yeah. And then I say, get rid of him, get the best you can for him. Look at what the Nuggets are doing. Better than the Knicks. Yeah. They oh. traded Carmelo. Cavs yeah. still suck. Heat, good. So it's the same. Yeah, and the Nuggets are holding their own. They don't have even have an all-star. They're second their in the too. West right now. Wow. Good for them. Good, good, good job. Good George nuggets. Carl, baby. Golden Nuggets. Huh. And uh, in the basketball slash hockey arena mm -hmm. built in the southern downtown district, of NBA. that's getting a little bit closer to happening, but we're still in beginning stages of sort of that speculation. There's a lot of hoops still to, to jump through, but <laughs> Oops. at least it's still a possibility at this See, point, but you don't want to get... Oh, Mostly, I've been I, I, I've said this a lot. Rays is a Seattle and Cleveland sports fan. I know to be very just guarded about things. But the people that I listen to, read, talk to, that I trust, say that this is one that you can actually get behind a little bit. There's more of a plan here. So okay. I'm ex Ugh, get, yeah, exactly getting. getting I can't there. finish it. I, but I'm kind of like okay. 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 I feel bad for Sacramento fans. If we take New Orleans. They got the Saints. Kings got nothing. They got a lot more history to lose. Mm -hmm. I feel yeah. for them. Yeah. Uh, who I don't feel bad for, Cortez Kennedy. Finally a Hoffa. Yeah. He Hall of Fame. Yeah. Uh, how many tries did it take him? Was that three, three or four? I think so. I think 2,099. Which one of those there. was his last one? I think. Yeah. Did he go to the playoffs with us or did he just miss that? He might have just missed I, I can't. I'm not sure. This is driving me nuts. I yeah. feel like I should, I should yeah. know this. But he, it took a few tries. He's in. And he's the second guy to go to the Hall of Fame who spent his entire career in Seattle, yeah. unless you count that Oilers uh, for a couple yeah, times. Yeah, yeah. But Lenny Wilkins, other teams can claim, can claim him. Dennis Johnson, most people think of him as a Celtic. Yeah. Largent and Cortez, second yeah, Seattle we'll, all the way. We'll just Love say, it. you know, lifetime Seahawks minus, you know, the little Oilers there. And then, you know, upcoming, because you know he's going to be a first ballot of Walter Jones oh, as soon yeah. as he goes in there. Big Walt. Uh, that, that's got to be. Yeah, that's yeah. got to be. And then, you know, you just look at that, and it's just those are three Seahawks you can look back and go, no off the yeah. field weird stuff. No, you know, I mean, it's hopefully you get Carl a micro Oller, fracture Franco surgery. Harris, but or Warren yeah, Moon. yeah. <laughs> it's not that one year that they play that, you know, they're all washed up. Uh, and, and not washed up either is Romar. He's getting his boys playing all of a sudden. Dogs, a little bit of a roll. I called the 2-0. Oh, good job. The Arizona school. I almost felt bad doing another show. They haven't lost since we no, did a show. No. <laughs> yeah, maybe the dogs have spoken. <laughs> I have spoken. <laughs> yeah, yeah we'll, we'll see about that. But, yeah. I mean, they go into Arizona State. You know, granted, you know, we thought that was coming. I mean, the, they, the Sun Devils weren't really doing that good. But at Arizona, that's still... The team to beat. And last uh, year, the another Houses down to the thing. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. Uh -huh. they, they beat, and then all of a sudden, you know, UCLA comes up. Oh, this is be, you know, close game. This is on, you know, ESPN. I nearly got wiped out by Josh Smith. When you see you bouncing 300 pounds of McDonald's <laughs> shaking at you, and he's about, what, 6'10? Six, 6'9? Six, 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 yeah. Is he 6'10? That thing was charging it towards you. me. The guy next to me got wiped out. <laughs> until about 10 minutes to go in the game when we finally were like, mm, all right, yeah. we're done. Uh -huh, Can I yeah. check on the game there, uh -huh, <laughs> Crone? Uh -huh. Tea, sir. Oh, thank you, Crone. You're so pleasant. Would you like to check on the race, sir? Yes, why not? And our UW football recruits, too. Uh, Lapoy, I think, making an immediate impact because guaranteed we got Shaq <laughs> we yeah. got Shaq and he can probably dunk Thompson <laughs> it sounds yeah, like what the way they're talking about yeah, Shaquille we'll call him Shaq Fu if he starts <laughs> railing up people but yeah. you know here's what I like we got him five star but I just have this feeling that there's going to be more to this story because 
I think sort of the way that Lapoy was sort of going out and then on top of him being recruited, I've just kind of heard some stuff from Cal going that he was kind of telling Shaq, hey, I'm going to be going to UW, start looking there and start. So I, I don't know if we got him in the best possible manner. And I hope um, it was all clean, but I think there might have been some, some shady doings and he didn't meet uh, Tedford at the airport on a recruiting trip. So I'm going to keep this as short as I can. But I'm really getting disenfranchised with college sports because of all this. There's so many coaching changes. The recruiting game is slimy, yeah. disgusting, despicable. And, you know, the way fans are getting on players. I mean, uh, Garnett, who went to Stanford, yeah. fans are railing on him. As a football fan, I'm disappointed he didn't go with UW. The man can get to Stanford yeah. to become, what, a doctor? Did anyone yeah, become a doctor? Yeah. Yeah. You're gonna be railing on a kid for good no. education. Yeah, he's 17, and then you got just this whole world going. How stupid! How stupid! You know, student <laughs> athletes. I know we forget student. that athlete. Student athlete. Student is how it's, I guess, pronounced. So, but I digress. Ho ho hopefully, that's all good. And the UW all of a sudden was looking at like the 40s. They got busted out yeah, of the top 45 goodness. for that. So we we oh. pulled that out of our hats at the oh. very very last minute and hey we got some nba jerseys going yes, on we so do. let's kind There's of e explain our picks here because we're not just repping the milwaukee bucks fear the deer fear the deer yeah. steer the queers out there steers and queers yeah uh, so the nba season starting especially with nfl going down we don't have as much to talk about yeah but we wanted to kind of pick teams that we we could get behind and also teams that you know you're gonna hear about the heat you're gonna hear about the lakers you're gonna hear about the clippers the yeah. knicks wanted to pick teams you're not going to hear as much about, just to kind of follow. So, obviously, being having strong ties to Cleveland, I'm going to keep an eye on the Cavs, kind of keep people abreast on what's going on with that. That's why I picked Cleveland. Yeah, I, I got a little orphan team because, you know, for football, it's the Texans mm -hmm. because they're not the Cowboys. Yeah. And I like that. They don't have the bajillion, jillion, Jerry Jones, Wally World Stadium to play in. Yeah. They just have a little reliant, and, oh, and that's it. You, you play over there. So, <laughs> you know, reliant. they they, they, <laughs> make, they make the playoffs with our third straight. TJ Yates coming in the house, <laughs> beat the Bengals. See, I kind of root for the Texans because they're the little team in Texas. But, uh, yeah, the Please, Milwaukee sir, Bucks. They want some they, more. They, they, Please, sir, I want some more. So I got a red Milwaukee just because it's going to be Packer land all the way oh, out yeah. there. When's the last time the Bucks did close to anything? Yeah, they went to the playoffs like, like last year, but they went to the like Eastern Conference Final with uh, Ray, you're right. Oh, yeah, Ray Allen. But, but before that, you got to look to Oscar <laughs> Robinson and Lou Alcender. We, I think he might have been Kareem at that point. There. Yeah. So, uh, you know, we, we got our NBA teams here, and so we'll kind of, we'll kind of breeze over, you know, the upcoming game. So they have the Suns. Shut up about the Sun! They got the Raptors, they got the Cavs, they got huh. Orlando, and they got the Heat. I, I see them maybe taking two. Yeah. Maybe taking two. It's going to be a battle of the losers. That's what I'm thinking. Is, uh, we're uh, going gonna to have a little uh, something to talk uh, about next uh, week. I'll, I'll totally take that. Uh, I, I don't think, I think you're going down, okay. uh, by okay. the way, because it's, it's in Cleveland, too. Okay. Yeah, Cavs have the Heat in Miami, so it's not as big of a deal yet. But then the Clips, Milwaukee, and Philly, so a really tough stretch. Okay. Milwaukee might be the uh, only one they get there, so we'll Good. see. Kyrie Irving! Vic, Wait, we didn't pick the Huskies. Tor, Oregon Reed. schools. At Oregon schools. It's okay. a victory for both of them. There it is. Oregon, right. Oregon State. Woo! Good save. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, Patrick. Love saving a dime. In the house. <laughs> right there. I'm going to say we're going to beat Oregon. Oregon State's going to upset us. Okay. Okay. Uh, now, victory formation. There yeah, it is. There you switch it up sometimes. Right? Yeah, yeah. Kevin Love, you're an idiot. I'm sorry. I don't care how mad you get on the court. You don't step on someone's face. Mm -hmm. Remember when you stepped on my face? <laughs> oh, no clip. Oh, thought we had a clip. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Tough to find that yeah. one. But yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, in American history, Exton, I guess, and did the, the old fashioned curb stomp. Yeah. Uh, and then it's really refreshing for NBA players to get all these lucrative contracts and go and play with it. But Dirk Nowitzki, he's only averaging like 17 points a game. That's his lowest since his rookie year. Yeah. He's like, you know what? I don't deserve to be on the All Star team. So. You know, have Kevin Love go, have Blake Griffin go, you know, have those guys, LaMarcus Aldridge, you know, there's a lot of good <laughs> West power forwards. I'm fine with sitting this one out, you know, and just let them be them. Yeah. Really refreshing yeah. to hear, okay? And this, you know, because fans are stupid like voting people. It's, oh, I know that name, All-Star. It's not even stats anymore. No. So thank you, Durka Durka. Durka Durka, Muhammad Jihad. Haka Sherpa Sherpa, Abakala. Oh, Durka Durka Durka. Yeah, yeah. All right, for the weekly sports report, this is Keeley, this is Bill K, and if you missed it, the Super Bowl show is in the description box. Go ahead and copy and paste that. I'd be fine with that. <laughs>